Billings Trailnet is a local nonprofit that has been working for years to better connect the city of Billings through bike trails and walking paths. Tonight they held their annual fundraiser, Ales for Trails, out at Zoo Montana. Q2's Mitch Leggy was there to find out what Billings Trailnet has been up to. Mitch? That's right. We're out here having a good time at Ales for Trails, the annual fundraiser for Billings Trailnet, able to help them construct and build more bike trails and walking paths throughout the city. And I'm joined here, uh, pleased to be joined by Christy Drake, the executive director at Billings Trailnet. Christy, thanks for joining me. Thanks for having me. And yeah. tell me a little bit about the fun party that we're all having here today. Well, this is our 19th year. This is uh, Ales for Trails. And um, gosh, we every year we get about 2,000 people out uh, to Ales for Trails. This is our second year having it at Zoo Montana. And it's such a great event. It really benefits the entire community because trails affect everyone, right? Definitely. They affect kids going to school. They affect people in wheelchairs. They affect all kinds of people from all different age levels and all physical ability levels. So it's uh, it's really a, just a great event that our community comes and celebrates active transportation. And you said 19th year this year, coming up on 20 years. How yeah. much money have you guys been able to give over the course of those years? We have raised raised uh, about 800000 or a little bit more than $800,000 over uh, the past 19 years from Ales for Trails. And uh, we've given $530,000 to the trail system. Wow, so quite a large amount. A, and, lot, uh, a lot of amount. <laughs> looking forward, what's, what's on the agenda for Trailnet? Well, we're trying to build a trail um, up along this uh, rims okay. uh, between Zimmerman Park and Swords Park. We call it the Skyline Trail. It's going to be on the south side of Highway 3 running along the, um, the, that whole ridge, and it's going to be about $3 million. The Billings Association of Realtors just gave us a $38,000 check because realtors know that that's, you know, people want to live near a trail, right? And what makes it so special about the trails here in Billings? So just having the ability to, to be on a trail away from traffic that's safe, that you can take your family out or you can take your girlfriend out or, you know, whatever, and, right. just, and just be along the trail. Train for that marathon or ride your bike to work or whatever it is that's what makes the trails so special is people people just want to be on them so and they connect our community definitely yeah. well thanks so much christy for joining me today Thank you. i appreciate it yeah. for males for trails out here back to you guys in the studio all right, thank you, Mitch. And if you'd like to help Trailnet to develop more paths in Billings, you can head to their website, billingstrailnet.org.